down the straight. Carrasco, an absolute bullet down the straight. She's going to be bringing Coppola and Danny Valle with her as well. And let's see what Mika Perez does here. Does he try and make the move before we get to the line as a little bit of a trial for the next lap? He does indeed. He's able to take that lead across the line. But look at Coppola, able to use the slipstream there from Anna Carrasco to try and get down the inside as well. All change here by the time we get from the, from the start-finish line into turn one. And Coppola down the inside now goes from fifth to second. And here we go, last lap underway. Garcia's gone from leading this race to now battling for fifth place with his teammate. It is Anna Carrasco hunting her first ever victory. A big move there from Garcia, pushes Perez wide. Perez forced to stand his Honda up, giving Anna Carrasco a fair bit of breathing room and it's Perez right back up the inside. Yeah, and that's the exact same as what we saw last time around where the lap, the move is made there by Garcia, but then he leaves himself open through turn four as well. Come down in towards turn five, this is where the big bump is. Just where Carrasco is now. Let's see what everyone's able to make it through there in one piece. Mika Perez, he's certainly been duffed up by this, Harry. He's gone from the lead back to fifth. Yeah, Perez, Garcia and Danny Valle really have to get a move on. Look how tight that championship would be if it were to finish like this. Because right now, Carrasco and Coppola do have about a half a second of breathing room. And we know that they're able to make up that half a second down the straight. But of course, as we said, the finish line so much closer to the last corner than the start line. And it looks like... Well, it looks like Mark Garcia, that is there, has really found a bit of pace. Is now right up there, looking for a way up the inside of Coppola. It's so tight there, he just manages to edge his way through on the who was the pole setter and who is the provisional championship leader. And looking there at Garcia, he's now putting the pressure onto Anna Carrasco down the inside into turn 13 as well. Does he run a little bit wide? Does he leave the door open for someone to try and come back on him? Looks like it's solid enough there from Mark Garcia, the championship leader, able to make a nice clean move. We've just only got turns 14 and 15, but we've seen everything can change very quickly here in these last couple of corners. Yeah, Mika Perez will get the benefit of the most slipstream. He is at the back there, but it looks like Mark Garcia has played this one to absolute perfection. Can Carrasco get that incredible drive? She has to watch for Alfonso Coppola as well. It's going to be all about the drag to the line. Mark Garcia, will he take it? No, Anna Carrasco and Alfonso Coppola come around the outside of Garcia to steal it right at the death. An incredible ride from Anna Carrasco. She takes a debut victory here in the World Supersport 300 Championship with Garcia forced to settle for third. Look at this action further down. That looks like Dorian Larreo there giving a bit of an elbow to Enzo Della Vega. Alex Murley picking up the last point ahead of Rosemary Putro and Ravelli. Our timing screens do show that there was 0.0, .0 of a second separating Carrasco from Coppola, but it is Anna Carrasco who becomes the first ever female winner of the World Supersport 300 class as she takes her debut victory. And look at that, the relief on her face, the pressure was on and she absolutely responded. Coppola taking second, Mark Garcia in third. So now just one point separating the top two in the championship. Coppola will lead with 102 points ahead of Mark Garcia on 101. Daru third with 84 points, 18 points behind. And then Mika Perez after that incredible charge to close down that big, big gap. He's fourth overall, 19 points down. So still anyone's game there you can see. Carrasco is being congratulated by everybody. An appropriate reaction from her team there as they explode into a round of applause, hugs everywhere. Our fifth different winner in World Supersport.